What's up, YouTube? Hudson Fan 15 back with another mail day. Uh, I just got back from dinner with my parents, and my father uh, is involved in a project. Uh, I'll tell you about that more in the weeks and months to come. But uh, part of it, he ran across a bunch of cards and uh, found some cult stuff for me, and he uh, was able to get uh, random assortment of stuff, basically from. Uh, the late 80s, early 90s, the present. Um, you know, like this Marvin Harrison, Chris Carter duel. Got some uh, Leaf uh, Limited 2000 numbered base. I've got a couple of Ken Dilgers numbered 1920 and 4003 out of 5000. That used to be uh, worthwhile. And uh, 1886 of 2000, because I guess he was a better player or something. Edron James, uh, SP Authentic, uh, Peyton Manning. He's got the Marvin Harrison from the same set. And a uh, Johnny Yu, great to the game. And his whole stack of other cards. Uh, a bunch of Marvin Harrison stuff. Uh, Dwayne Biasucci, a kicker. John Hand. Steve Eneman, Shane Curry, Eugene Daniel, Aaron Bailey, uh, Jeff the Disaster George, Marshall Falk, Ron Stark, Keith Taylor, uh, Al Jabbar, Abdul Kareem, yeah, all that. Quentin Corriott, Sam Clancy, Dwayne Bickett, uh, Jesse Hester, Bill Brooks, Lamont Warren, who I don't even remember being on the team. Um, I guess he was there for a while. Uh, E.G. Green, Fred Young, Pat Beach, uh, it's, it's Clarence Verdon, I mean, and Chip Banks, some real obscure ones. Jeff Herod, uh, stuff that's from the a lot of stuff from the era where they really stunk. Kirk Loudermilk, uh, obviously Eric Dickerson. Uh, there's a couple Eric Dickersons in here. Albert Bentley, Anthony Johnson. So, uh, random, really random assortment of cold space. So, uh, thanks to uh, my father for that one. Uh, shout out to dad there. Um, got a couple of pieces of mail, uh, and then I'll go over a, a big trade I did. Uh, got a uh, another one of these uh, 2003 uh, absolute. Uh, two, I'm sorry, 2002 absolute memorabilia team tandems uh, dual patch. Uh, one color Hudson, three color Zito out of 50. Got that for four bucks shipped. Uh, this card is gone. I've seen it go as high as 30 bucks. So when one popped up with a $15 buy it now plus shipping, I had to dive on it because I haven't seen one in a while either. It's a uh, Tim Hudson 2011 uh, Tops Heritage Tops Stamp, number 30 is 62 with Danny Valencia. I think the Valen Valencia drives it up. And. Uh, have the other one of Hudson's from that set on the way, and then this uh, I I didn't realize how, exactly how off center it was until it got to me. But uh, it's a 2004 Diamond Kings number two of five Tim Hudson autograph, and it is like 90 10 off center, top to bottom. So that was a little bit of a surprise, but no big deal. Um, then we got a. One from uh, Tim, Y.E. Cards 95. Hey, Tom, you probably need this, so here you go. Talk to you soon, man. Y.E. Cards. He must have just cracked his case and like dropped his card off in the mail the same day because it got here lightning fast. Uh, to 2011 Topps Chrome uh, Hudson Refractor. Just the regular refractor. So I obviously did not have anything uh, Hudson uh, 2011 Chrome yet because it's still being actively cracked right now so uh, none of the plates and none of the um, the red refractor I don't think they've been found I uh, went to the Big E on uh, Friday the Eastern States Exposi Exposition in uh, Agawa, Massachusetts uh, got a couple of things um, including a shirt from Hot Leathers which I, I hit them every year got this black titanium skull and crossbones ring it's something different. I got a regular ring that I wear on my my hand opposite my wedding ring, and it's starting to get chipped and whatever. So I wanted to uh, 
not retire it, but like kind of alternate between the two to you know maybe make that one live longer, maybe you know make them both live longer. So um, that was Friday, and then Saturday, uh, I'm sorry, uh, Sunday, I went up to um, see Nick uh, Mizzy uh, 1995 on eBay. And uh, now he has finally gotten off his ass and made a YouTube. Uh, it's Yankee. It's Y A N K E. So one e ninety five. Uh, I'll put a link to him in the description box. Uh, you guys can all uh, go give him a sub, give him a proper welcome to the community. Uh, he collects uh, Yankees, Cowboys, UConn players. Uh, so we have a bit of an overlap with Donald Brown, and he's gonna have some nice mail coming in his. Um, Reggie Bush, Ladanian Tomlinson, his dad collects Chiefs, so, uh, you can check out his page for everything, uh, it's pretty basic, I don't even know if he's uploaded a video yet, but, uh, now that he's actually made the account, I can stop, you know, redirecting you guys through eBay or whatever to talk to the kid, uh, he's got some really nice stuff, I'm hoping that he gets a bucket going, uh, maybe makes a for trade video here and there, he's been on blog a number of times, so, um, he had some stuff for me. We ended up doing a giant trade. Uh, I'd gotten some stuff for him, uh, something for the set that he's working on, some Cowboys stuff. So, uh, but you can check that. And he also does Yankee Stadium giveaway stuff. So if you've got any Yankee Stadium giveaway stuff, that that is right up his alley. And he will trade uh, SGA for cards. Uh, so he had this uh, Allen Ginter uh, Rampage card, which I do not have. And uh, I believe Rampage will once again uh, regain his title. Uh, I, I do like John Jones very much, but there's just this aura about Rampage when he's in a title fight that it's just I can't dismiss. Um, one of the things he did when he was there is I got um, I had that I, have, I don't even know if I showed it. I had a 2011 Topps football retail box, and he was going for the uh, the code. Program. I, I don't know much about it, but I guess you redeem a certain amount of codes that you get in packs, and you can get things like Joe Namath autographs and, and such. So I guess that's what he was going after, and uh, I think the codes that were in this box put him over the top. So that was part of our deal, but um, he was just throwing me Colts cards as he was going through the box. Uh, Super Bowl Legends uh, insert of Peyton Manning. Uh, Topps Town, Peyton Manning. Uh, Jacob Tammy, base. He knew he had that one already, so I think that was about it. And there may be some others along the way here. Um, Joseph Dye, SPX, rising rookies of uh, Wayne and Clark, and uh, also of Peyton. Uh, I believe this is the 97 Upper Deck uh, Legends set that they've been doing the, the buyback autos on in, in the Ultimate Collection. Uh, Johnny Yu, uh, Ray Berry Sports Legends, uh, Manning Wayne, uh, Tops insert there, Ray Berry uh, Reproduction, uh, this is not a reproduction uh, from the uh, 70s, this is, uh, I believe this is 1977 Tops, uh, Joe Ehrman, uh, 1990 Pro Set Super Bowl Superman Johnny Unitas. Uh, ben Hartstock rookie. Uh, really nice looking, in my opinion, design on this one. Uh, Fleer Faces of the Game 2006. Uh, Peyton Manning. I think it's just a great looking insert card. Insert Revolution for the win right there. I've uh, got a Reggie Wayne Stars of the Game. Uh, 20th Anniversary uh, Peyton Manning. 20th Anniversary Upper Deck. Uh, Tops Kickoff. Uh, Reggie Wayne. Heroes, Peyton Manning, I think it's one of the high numbers. Uh, 2007 Donruss Threads, Century Legends, Peyton Manning. Oh my God. Uh, Ultra, Ultra Performers, Peyton Manning. Uh, Gridiron Tributes, Marvin Harrison, out of uh, Fleer Tradition 2004. As that falls over. Alright, uh, I've got uh, Marvin Harrison's scouting report insert out of 250. Uh, 
23 of 50 out of threads. Dallas Clark, base card parallel. Pierre Garçon, rookie card, 975 out of 999. Uh, Tops Unrivaled, gold parallel, uh, out of 759 of Joseph Dye. Deloney Carter, rookie card, 498 out of 999. Uh, this oversized jersey, numbered 4 of 88, uh, 2005, Ultra Sensations, Marvin Harrison. Uh, 06, Flair Showcase, Reggie Wayne, Showcase Stitches. 07, Don Russ Threads, 68 out of 500, Anthony Gonzalez, jersey. And a 2009 SPX X Factor signatures of Jacob Tanning. So that would be the Colt stuff. And follow that up with uh, just a few Hudsons. Uh, the uh, Bowman Sterling jersey, regular one. The uh, 2011 Tops Allen Ginter jersey. Uh, number 8 to 35. 2006 Ultimate Collection, Ultimate Numbers, Materials, Jersey of uh, Hudson, obviously. And then number 13 of 50. I guess he found this up in the Cooperstown area uh, when he was up there on a little family vacay. So a little, uh, little special meaning to this one. It is the uh, 2008 Topps Silk Collection. So I'm fairly certain I have that one, but I do like the fact that he got it up in the uh, the Cooperstown area as a, as a nice little aside to the whole thing. So I implore you to go subscribe, get some trades going with uh, Nick Yankee95 on uh, both Blog TV and YouTube. Link to him will be in the description box. Uh, he's been toying around the idea of doing a local show, so he's got uh, a pretty extensive inventory. He's got his own card room uh, in his house uh, with a sort of hanging out, and uh, gotta tell you, there is a lot of stuff. I saw a lot of stuff for a lot of community members. Uh, I did pick up a couple of things uh, for a couple of people, just kind of smaller-ish stuff, but. Um, I was literally like going through stuff saying, oh, this person would like this, this person was like this, this person would like this. I just didn't have the trade ammo to get it off him. But uh, definitely uh, send him who you collect and uh, he will uh, he will let you know. Uh, and Tim, uh, White Cards 95 I did ask him to look for anything Daniel Hudson he had for you. So uh, you're, uh, you're covered on that one, trust me. And uh, uh, thanks once again. Thanks to uh, my father for the cold stuff. All right, YouTube. Peace.